be sure to tell him about your job. You know, the, the job that you were telling me that was so heavy. Oh, oh well, the, I did. The bob, was it the bob? Yeah. Oh, yeah, big, I, I used to have to, to push tell. crates it was as long as this sofa, that wide. Whew. And they'd just be piled up like this. Wow. And they, they were on the top shelf of the frames. Mm -hmm. This and then you went along, you had to take them down, put them in that, and you'd have that thing piled completely up. And uh, because I ran a winder mm -hmm. to start with until I got my hand tore up in one. So then they moved me over on the weighing machines and I'd have those big uh, things of yarn to have to push on the scales and off the scales and then push them to the back part of the mill. And they would weigh over 500 pounds at times, and I weighed 85. <laughs> and I couldn't push them front without I'd have to turn around and push them with my back. That's the reason I guess my back's all pieces now. But uh, it was hard work. All of it. it. All the work in the mill was hard work. There wasn't no easy work in there. So, but, um, so when did you start working at the mill? And, and when I was 15, mm -hmm. I was going to school and getting off of work at 2 o'clock, come home from school and go to work and work till 11 at night. Or either during the war years, we worked on Saturday nights and we'd work till during the week and all, 12, 12, 30, 11, 30. Just when we could get called up, we'd call it. And then we would... I, I did that until I made my grade to the 11th grade. I was 16 then. And I went two days in the 11th and I quit and went to work full time mm -hmm. in the mill. And I worked until my baby was born after I got married. And so then I quit work and I didn't go back anymore. But my dad went to work in there when he was eight years old. And my mama went to work in there when she was 10. And my dad worked till he retired at uh, 65. And then he died at 66. He didn't oh. live but a year after he retired. And I had three brothers and they went to work in there when they were about 15 or 16. And all three of them worked in there until they all died. Wow. And so tell me, you said you're, you're Father and mother worked in in the mill, right? Mm -hmm. So, and they started when they were really My young. Dad was eight. eight. He got five cents a day. He said he had a little wire hoop, and when he'd go to work every morning, he would roll that little hoop to the mill because he was played, you know. It was, and he hide it under the stairs until he'd get off of work, and then he'd get his hoop and roll back, roll it back on. And uh, the reason though. He, uh, we were here, we came to Rocky Mount. My dad lived in Halifax, my mom, they came from Castalia. And mom said that my granddaddy heard that if you came, there was a mill in Rocky Mountain, you could make a lot of money. So they gave up the farm and the big two-story house and just walked away and left it. Packed up everything they had on the mule and wagon and came to Rocky Mount. And they got number 13 Spring Street, the house we were all born in. All of us were born there, and he went, they went to work in the mill, and my dad had to go to work in the mill when he was eight years old. I, well, you know, back a long time ago when we were children, uh, I remember like, you know, at Thanksgiving or Christmas, it was Christmas, and the mill, they closed down for a while, Didn't they, and the mill company were giving away churches. Don't you remember that? You could go down there at Christmas and they'd give you a turkey because the mill closed down yeah. for about several weeks, you know. Oh, wow. And I've known them to do that two times, close up for tw twice like that. And so you'd get a turkey, but people wouldn't be paid then mm -hmm. for mm -hmm. what, how, how long? Well, you, you'd get your last week's work pay and you didn't get no more and you went back to work. And like, like with Daddy, do you remember when your Daddy retired? Daddy um, only got a dollar a year mm -hmm. retirement. My, my Daddy didn't. My mom would, uh, got, um, my Daddy I think got about 
It was him and Mama one didn't get but sixty. Yeah, so dollars. Sixty cent retirement. Uh, sixty cent retirement. Uh -huh. I think that was Mama. Uh, yeah. And I, the, and I think they said that that it, it she draw that because of my daddy. Mm -hmm. And my daddy didn't get nothing either. Mm -mm. And when my hand got tore up down there, yeah, so I didn't I get should... I didn't get one penny. And and Did they you... called me to come out to the office to Did sign you file paper. For it? Well, see, I was just six, I was about 16 then I was 17, I mean. Anyway, I didn't know what I was signing. I thought I was signing up to get my, get some money. Compensation. Mm -hmm. oh. it's compensation. And so I didn't even read the paper and I signed it and then signed away all my rights. I got no insurance, no nothing. My dad had paid all the hospital bill and everything. Mm -hmm. 